Tonight, we're learning more about the woman who was hit head on by a car while riding her bike northeast of Clovis over the weekend. 51 year old Adela Maluli was on a bike ride in the Fresno County foothills when she was hit on Watts Valley Road. As our Catherine Phillips reports, Maluli was a beloved professor at Clovis Community College. The California Highway Patrol says at this point there hasn't been any charges filed against the driver in this case, but they say they want everyone to watch for bicycles and share the road. The California Highway Patrol says on Sunday morning, officers responded to a crash on Pittman and Watts Valley Road in the foothills of Fresno County. They say an Acura was driving eastbound and drifted into the westbound lane where 51-year-old Adela Santana Malui was riding her bike. CHP says she died at the scene of the crash. Sergeant Joseph Bianchi says at this point, they don't know what made the driver veer into the opposite lane. Preliminary investigation indicate that, that um, there wasn't any um, indication of alcohol or drugs. Uh, the driver did stop and cooperate with the investigation. Clovis Community College Vice President Lori Bennett says Santana was a dedicated anthropology teacher for years. She is brought enthusiasm and creativity and ideas to the college. She says Santana just became a full time faculty member recently and says she was so excited for her new position. The sheriff's office says she was also a lecturer at Fresno State. But she was so honored to be a full time faculty member and to be part of this college that um, that is one of the things that people are talking about today is how much she loved this job and how happy she was to be able to be full time working with students. CHP says as they continue to investigate the case, they want to remind drivers to share the road with bikes and to limit any distractions. Anytime there's any kind of error in judgment or attention or whatever, um, you know, obviously it results in some traumatic um, circumstances, unfortunately. CHP says at this point they aren't sure what kind of charges the driver could be facing. Reporting in Fresno, Catherine Phillips, KC24, Local News That Matters.